Hey everybody, I'm your host Chris K-R-I-S and today we will be starting on till dawn uh, a game I never played before well minus the first three seconds when the the brightness slider popped up and I had to reset real quick uh, but other than other than the first three seconds I've never played this game before this is a blind playthrough I've wanted to play this game for many years so before we go into this if you played the game before no tips of course no spoilers but uh, most importantly, do not try to tell me how to play this game. Go into this game expecting everyone to die because that's how things are going to be. There we go. That's This is the furthest I made it. Uh, adjust the slider until the logo is barely visible. I, I don't see any logo, man. Does anyone see a logo? Okay. Uh, I'll leave it at that, man. Uh, select your preferred method of control. What now? You can play as different types. Oh, that's bullshit. I'm going to get screwed. You can change this at any time. Oh, thank God. Motion controls, traditional. I'm gonna go with traditional. Hope by traditional they mean fixed camera angles and tank controls. I I, I wouldn't mind that at all. Man, I I'm just hoping this game is really fucking badass uh, uh, experience for me. I'm I'm looking forward to it. I like me some hit in the air. Not so much that bug-eyed motherfucker from from Night Museum though. Oh, look at this. This is so cool. All right. All right. All right. Bonus content. I didn't get any bonus content. Uh, control options. We already did that. Audio. Subtitles on. Always on, dude. Why not? Sidebar text. What? Enable or disable overlay text for written material while playing. Uh, I don't know what that means. I'll, I'll turn it on anyway because subtitles are important in every game for me. I, I, don't, I don't know what, sub, what this sidebar shit is though. So I'm going to leave it on just in case it's also important. Show global stats? No, fuck that. I don't, I don't care about how you did. Ah, you don't mean shit to me. Fuck that. Hell no. Hell no. You're coming at me with that bullshit. Status and collectibles. There's collectibles now? Oh, dude, look at this. The twins. Oh, fucking spoilers! Butterfly. I'm really expecting this to be some badass, uh, heavy rain book. But even better edition of a uh, a choice game, you know. That's what that's what I'm hoping for. Maybe I should pay attention to everything, though. I heard, I have heard, you know, some non non spoilery things like sometimes no option is the best option. And I'm like, motherfucker, I don't know what that means. I'm just gonna die. Ah <laughs> oh, shit, this is gonna be good. So, is that desert or some shit on a butterfly? Are we gonna go somewhere? Your story. It's one of many possibilities. You know, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I will cheat a little. If I get an hour into the game and four of my fucking characters are dead, I'm resetting. Fuck that. <laughs> I want a good experience, not a bullshit one. If the game is five minutes long for me, God, I'm gonna fall out a window and just smack my head. Maybe a glitch. I'm gonna fall, yeah, I'm gonna fall through the fucking floor. Face through it. Hey. Got some teenagers. Mm, yes. In a cabin all alone. Oh. And then the neighbor comes on over for some sugar. You know what I mean? Here he comes now. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. <laughs> Deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl M. What a bitch. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, M. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. It's kind of weird seeing Hayden Penetier's face with like weird video game movement. Hannah! <laughs> <laughs> She's here. Shh, shh. Mike. Uh, hello. Mike. It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. I'm sorry, last I checked, we were all adults. Since when, since when have we become 12-year-olds hiding under beds? Hey, did you see that? 
Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Oh shit, I'm controlling already? Hey. You you awake, man? I'm gonna explore the crap out of this game. I'm gonna make sure that I don't leave any cupboard unopened. Any I'm wearing Ugg boots or some shit. What's this about? I, I wanted to play some fine ass young women with with fashion sense, not some beanie wearing dipshit. You can't you know, how how do you even open doors in this? Hey yo, who the hell are you, man? You need to wake your ass up. I saw something outside. It looked peculiar. Maybe you should go check alone. Look around. Oh, for fixed camera angles. Oh, oh look, fixed camera angles in 2017. This is what I want. Hello, anybody? I swear, I don't know if half the shiny things are things I can pick up. Uh, because every time I go over to them, they disappear. Got a little dining room around here. Got some sexy ass windows boarded up. I don't know why the lights are off though. Are they alert? Like, they're there. What the hell is this? And that behind me? What's, what's, what's that fucking shit following me? Right, let, let's ignore that for now. It's probably just a, a ghost. One of them ghost twins or something that popped up in the collectible menu. Uh. Alright. There, there's another fucking shiny. Alright, give me a second. Whoa, what did I do? Oh shit, her name is Bet. She's halfway honest, charitable, funny. Oh man, she, she had no sense of humor. Bit of a romantic, no, not really. Curious. Oh, relationship statuses. Oh, that's pretty cool. She's best friends with Hannah. Oh, I'm liking this. Oh, this is fucking awesome. Right. Whoa. Uh, use your right analog stick to look around. Objects uh, that glint can be can be uh, uh, obtained. Did I say that? I didn't sh see shit. Or two. Uh, press and hold or two. Hello. Press and hold or two. The right stick. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Nice. G can I get subtitles? There we go. You look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m., winky face. Mike. Oh, my oh. God. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Oh, so they're sisters. Are you one of the twins? Hey, yo, we got twins in the cabin, dude, and you're falling asleep? You're missing out. You don't know what the fuck's going on. This guy's a dipshit. There's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so there's nothing around here. I'm getting out of here. Let's go upstairs. Hello? This is the stairs, right? No, that's a fucking wall. I can't see shit, dude. An empty bottle of garbage. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Mm. Whoa, dude. What's going on? Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Damn, she's all about it. Oh my god, she's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this all got out of Just a stupid prank. Uh, Hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! <gasps> uh, use the rice stick to choose. To choose what? Wake Josh. I didn't see the fucking thing. Josh. Get your ass up. Josh. Fuck. Oh, we fucked. We fucked. Guys, there's someone outside. Hello? What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We just messed around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Press the control action oh, before the timer. Okay. 
Okay. Whoa, square. We got this. If this is how the game is played, I'm gonna kick its ass. So so far, I like the girls, and uh uh uh, uh fast. Yeah. How? This way. We got it. We got it. I, I'm, I'm not afraid of anything. I can kick the shit out of anyone that shows up. But so far, I like the twins, and I like uh, Hayden Panettiere. The rest of them can rock. But uh, it might be it might be wise to try to keep as many alive as possible. Oh shit! Follow footprints. We'll, we'll go this way. Where are you at, girl? Come on out! Damn it! Now that's some bullshit right there. I got screwed over. Jesus! Fuck! Shit! You want to call out for help? You want to call her Damn name? It, Hannah. Where are you? Well. Um. Where you at, girl? Use a touchpad as shown. Oh, that's so cool! I never done that before. Status update. Hannah. Status update like this. Current objective: find Hannah. Uh, butterfly effect. Any, any of your business? What? I I, I don't know. What, what's what's the point of all this? Go home. Anything here that that would be of any use to me? No. Oh well, then what's the point? You can direct a light beam with the right arm stick. Oh shit. Hello? Girl, where are you at? It's me, your sister. All fine and in pink. Just looking for some company, you know what I mean? <laughs> no, seriously, girl. I'm not coming out here all night long. Fuck off, man. I'm not staying out here all night long looking for your ass. Walk faster. I can do that. Maybe I have to find her before the cold sets in. And she freezes Hello? her little booty up. Hello? Okay, how about you call her phone? You have the phone in your hand. You haven't even tried yet. Or two. A little statuette. No, no, pick it up, motherfucker. You do that right. X. Or two, right? Nice. Whoa, fuck! Uh, shouldn't have picked that up. Was this me falling off a cliff? I'm gonna start walking. Uh, I, 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 I ain't gonna be running around this area anymore. Huh? Hey, girl. You, you, you wanna come out so we can get back to the fucking cabin Anna. real goddamn quickly? Please. Uh, I'm not too happy right now. I, I just saw my own face getting all bloody. Oh, shit! Who the fuck's this? The hell was Listen, Anna. I'm not here to fight. Hannah. Hello? Hannah. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here. Why'd you come this far? I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Yes. Hannah, is that? Oh shit, already? It's starting off like this? I'm not prepared! Go! Go! Oh fuck! Stick together! Stick together! Oh no! I've seen this shit! I don't I don't I don't I don't wanna fall! Okay, let Russia us and then we both jump opposite directions and then jump off the cliff! Oh, thank God! <laughs> that was gonna be a restart. Fuck no. Two minutes into the game. Hold it breathes on. fire. Hold on. Fuck off, asshole. I'm a little busy. Ah. Uh, uh, yeah. See you in hell, asshole. Um, 
Fuck that. That's a reset. <laughs> Fuck that. That's a reset. Fuck no. I ain't playing the game. No, Before fuck we begin, that. There are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes. Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. So does that not count? Did, did that, All was right. that a warm up? We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. it All right. It's essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Um, sure, dude. Whatever you say, man. Uh, it's just some fucking Idaho farm. It has nothing to do with me. I never even seen a scarecrow. What's this about? So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Well, it makes me feel uneasy because it makes me think of the Goosebumps okay. episode. Honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? I, I told you, man. The Goosebump episode where all the, the motherfuckers come to life. Anyone remember I that episode? See. I see. Let's see. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say, oh, for example, at night time, uh, in the middle of nowhere. I I'm a little freaked out. I don't like that. I don't like isolation no. that bad. Why not? I'd be lonely. Uh, I wouldn't say scared. Ah, fuck it. I I'm a little bit of a pussy. Why not? Is there something else in that picture that scares you? Yeah, it's me in a cabin or some barn in the middle of nowhere. You know? It's like, it's me in pure darkness at night time. Fuck that. That's intriguing. But perhaps we can explore the depths of your fears the next time we meet. I'm afraid we're out of time for now. Do I have to pay you? How much do I owe you for that, dude? What's your name? So you're my, like, psychiatrist? Don't tell me I killed the fucking girl straight away. That sucked. That sucked. Some bullshit right there. I do not count that for anything. That was a bullshit opener. Go left or go right, and then I died? Like, what happens if I let go? The other chick would have died instead, and that thing probably would have grabbed my ass. I want to recount. I, I, I need some time traveling powers. How was, how was I supposed to know, man? Like, by the time I got the fucking death totem that showed me my future, breaking my spine, it was too late. I couldn't turn back. It was just a big fuck you. Loving the intro. That's one of the reasons I love this, this game from everything I've heard about so far. It's basically a, a fucking slasher flick. 
you know? Only in video game form. And I love those shitty films. Scream is one of my favorite movies of all time. So, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm hyped. I'm fucking hyped. I just hope that I don't get fucked over like that again. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Fuck! Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Look at that motherfucker. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Woo! <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And that, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so, let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! <laughs> that guy seems to be taking it rather well, you know? Maybe he turns out to be pretty useful to us. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of that guy, though. As an actor, he kind of weirds me out a little bit. Blackwood Pine. Oh, this is gonna be the grave of many of my friends. This is gonna go so bad. I am not looking forward to this. I'm freaking out. I fucked up so bad. I hope there was nothing you could do about that. I really do. Because that was just brutal. I can't believe it went so wrong so fast. Memento Mori. Ten hours until dawn. Shit. The fuck am I meant to do about that? I'll go home, dude! No one cares! I bet he's not even a killer. I bet he's like a, ma a mountain man who's like, Yo, there's demons around here. They breed fire and they throw twins off cliffs. Hannah's best friend. Considerate, adventurous, diligent. Oh, I'm so perfect in every way. No one could ever doubt me as being the innocent protagonist of this game. Surely I'll Hello? live. Someone there? Path to the cable station, 902. Ah, oh, man. Okay, can I, can I walk a bit faster? I like your style, girl. You can use the right stick to move the camera. Yeah, we got that. I mean, the last tutorial threw me off a fucking cliff. So I'm not sure I should be... Oh, hey. Uh, look around for objects. Objects. The glint. Uh, hello? Oh, what? The gate's busted. <sighs> Climb over, Chris. 
Man! Can't you just like ram a car through it? Hold on, let me look over here first. Some bullshit. I see you looking at me up there, motherfucker. Come on down. I'll kick your ass right now. Fucking changing that camera angle trying to spook me. I, I, I'm too worried for my own shit right now. Uh, let's do it quickly. I want to I wanna test my digits out, you know, my dexterity. Uh, yeah. Uh, see, I got this. I, I'm on top of things. Climb a bit further. Come on. You got this, Spider-Man. Uh, Look at that little pink backpack. Shit, this isn't a school trip, girl. We're here to party like porn stars. Didn't you hear Bug Eyes? Ah, I, I, I'm not a fan of him. He seems like a try-hard actor. But I'm sure he'd be a cool guy soon enough. I'm going to give him a chance. If, if he redeems himself in this game, I'm going to watch all his movies and TV shows. Uh, This way? Shit. I'm a little worried. Fucking Hannah and Bet, man. <laughs> hey, hey fella. You hungry? Huh? Fuck! Oh, damn it. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. That's it. Come on. Okay. I didn't move a damn thing that time though. I like barely flinched. Can I turn this off? This is <laughs> this is nerve wracking. Oh, that's gonna fuck me up. I am so dead. Uh, unsure of what to do next, you can see your current objective by pressing R1. No, I'm okay. This is a beautiful location. This is gorgeous. I'm loving this. Look at this. This is a fucking fantastic setting for a video game. Hey, can I read this? <laughs> cool. That's a lot of text. Uh, tribes who once lived in these mountains believe that butterflies carry dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Death. Black butterflies prophesied the dreamers death. Danger. Red butterflies warned of dangerous events. L uh, loss. Brown butterflies foretold of tragedy affecting friends. Uh, scroll. Guidance. Yellow butterflies offered visions to help the guy, uh, uh, the help and guide. White brought dreams and luck and fortune. Oh, we need to find some. We need to find some white. <laughs> What's this? This looks like yellow. If you explore, you can discover uh, totem artifacts. Picking up a totem and turning it will reveal a colored butterfly. So if I if I find a black one and I don't pick it up, will that prevent me from getting fucked over? That didn't do shit. What, what the hell did that mean? That didn't mean shit. The future's uncertain. No shit. It showed a fucking bird. Okay. Oh, anyone can make that shit up. It's like, oh, t tomorrow you're, go you're gonna dr drink some liquid. I I I'm a psychic, you guys. I, b I bet you're gonna piss today. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude. Right. Chris? You here? Fuck. No, I'm looking around. If, if there's going to be totems and collectibles, I'm going to find everything. need all the information I can get. I'm basically going to be detective mode the entire game. Wow, graffiti all the way up here. The past is beyond our control. Written in red marker. Fucking kids. Now, I, I don't want to see any of this bullshit happening this year. If some motherfucker wants to hide underneath a bed or some horse shit like that, I'm going to kick her ass out in the That's snow. Here, you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello. What do we have here? That's just fucking rude, dude. Don't pick that up. Uh Fuck. You know, he'll understand. It's like, hey, your phone was ringing. I I I picked it up for you. Aha. Look who it is. Answer it. He knows it. Chris. He has a crush on Ashley. He's a little humorous. All right. I, I, he, he knows how to take a joke. He won't get angry at me for this. Right? You scared me. 
I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Don't be so fucking up your own ass, bitch. You don't got this skirt. You can't talk to me like that. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. My mind. Fair enough. Uh, hold on. Wait, I, I wasn't done exploring. Like this right here. What the hell is this? Clue found. Wanted poster. Oh man, give me a second. I had to read all this. You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Maybe. Looks like someone thought so. Oh come on, this place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Ooh, July nineteen ninety eight. That's the year Resident Evil One takes place. Maybe they're connected. <gasps> Same universe, perhaps? We got fixed camera angles. You don't know. Hey, dude. Ta da. Red, right? What am I looking at? Yeah. Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Want to try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right, here goes. Don't take your shoulder out, dude. You fucking blow that out. I'm not gonna be saving your ass later on. Oh fuck, I have to do it? Uh, use your right leg stick to aim or two to shoot. No problem, man. I I'm an expert at this shit. Watch this, girl. Right? Bitch, press that or two button, motherfucker. Yeah! Down there? Oh, watch. Pop! Yeah! That's what I like! I got the skills! Where else? Oh shit. Watch this, girl. Watch this. Eyes closed! No problem. Wow! Nice shooting tits. Alright. I'm bad. I'm a badass. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, no, I don't think so, girl. Uh, choose the target to aim at. I'm gonna go with the further one. It's more impressive. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. <gasps> I'm not gonna shoot a squirrel. That's fucked up. Hell no. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Oh, there's the bird, right? I don't know, it showed a fucking bird earlier. Now I'm playing this dipshit. I'm sorry, if anyone likes this guy, I just want to apologize in advance. I just have a thing with uh, the CH Chris's. They're a bunch of little bitches normally. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here goes fast. I want to make sure all the characters get the information needed, because I don't think they're sharing the mind, you know, like most video games. So I'm going to I'm gonna be sure that everyone knows what's going on. So if you see me, you know, reading a note that's twice really with different gosh. people, you, you'll understand. Hey, that's weird. I'm not going to get fucked Far's over. Off. Hell yeah. no, not again. Josh wanted us to keep it locked, to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Eh. Yeah, you're homeless, you're cold. Where the fuck would you sleep? Keep it locked. Okay, can I can I open it another way? Or just kick it open? After you. Oh, real gentleman. You wish. At least we're not wearing Uggs. Oh, so sexy. Look at these camera angles. Hey, girl. Girl, girl, girl. Hey, yo. I'm going to be over here for a second. You just chill out. I'll see if I can put the heat on or something. I thought the car was closer. Guess we got to wait. What's this information about? For a healthy body and mind. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. I'm not so rich. 
Stanley fought a mountain. Ooh, we got a television. Is this the cabin? Huh? So it's kind of like cabin in the woods. We're going to get some underground labs and shit too. Hey. Hey, yo, I need you to come up here and look at this in case we get fucked up and someone needs to look at the cameras. Did I hear something? We got some goggles? Pick up the goggles, dude! I need to make... Uh, I'm, I'm so fucking paranoid. I am not getting screwed over. Finally, you coming? I would no, totally survive this I game in real life. Stay here and catch some Z's, but... Her style is all over the place. I like it. Hell yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Just double checking. Just double checking. Making sure all the areas are, are known to, to my eyes. Get that mental image going on. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap-snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends. To this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. So we're all here because some creepy pervert back in school couldn't leave one little girl alone. And and what did he do last year? Fucking around with someone else? Who ended up dead? Not my fault by the way, just wanna remind everyone that. Jess. Hey Jess, new girlfriend. You're trusted? You're that trusted? Irrelevant. <laughs> uh, Alright. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Please be nice. Please be nice. I need I need nice friends. Let me look around for a second, little Jess. Uh, so what? Who do we have right now? We have Chris. We have Sam, Manta, and uh, we now have Jessica. All right, fair enough. Oh fuck what you! The hell? Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. Sure. Just uh, no more loud noises, all right? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. You're a dipshit. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Uh, insist. Uh, what? Well, I'm with Mike now. Give that back. No, uh, we don't need to explain ourselves, but give it back seems kind of childish. Fuck it. We'll go and explain it a little bit. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. Huh. 
All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Emily, Mike's ex, out for revenge. She's intelligent and resourceful. Oh, oh, she's gonna be very important to this story. Not irrelevant at all. Then Mike is pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. He's a model and motivated. Look at me, I'm so pretty. I paint my lips this color. You know. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Man, I'm carrying her bags. Matt's the bitch of the group. All right, bellboy, get them shit up to my room. Don't fuck up. <laughs> Don't fuck up on the way there. You slip, you break my makeup. I break your leg. You got that? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's you see be this? Weird seeing everyone up here again. I mean. What do you think? Ah! Jesus! <laughs> he, he has such a creepy face on him. He's driven? Driven to what? To murder? <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice I'm one. sure Michael, you did. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? Eh. No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. Uh, Trenton, back off, Mike. We're all friends here. Oh. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um. This is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. <laughs> uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back on the trip. All right. See you, man. That see animation ya. was awesome. All right. See ya. I, I want to see that animation again. That was cool as fuck. Crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Um, uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. I'm not leaving you alone. Uh... Oh, well, fuck off. All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. She just wants to talk like to Mike. Only one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. She's gonna be all like, oh, Mike, uh, I missed you. I don't know what you see in that Jessica. She's just a irrelevant little brat. And he's gonna be like, well, what about Matt? You seem to got a new replacement really quickly. And then she's gonna be all like, oh, him? He just carries my bag for me. Cause I'm racist and he's black. You notice that? The only black guy carrying the bag for everyone? <laughs> Ashley, ooh, has a crush on Chris. Why? Why? No, 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 get, get, get the hell out of here. Oh! Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Fucking called it. Look at that. Dirty cheater. Dirty cheating. Oh! Ah! Oh! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> Hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to 
scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Hey, well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Encourage, take a look. Yeah, fuck that! I'm not gonna lie. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh, son of a bitch! Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? No. Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. Oh, teen drama. I love it. What's going to happen? I I'm going to be the cause of a big fist fight. Can I get everyone to fight each other like a, a battle royale? Everyone just in the living room beating the shit out of one another. Hey, Jess. What's up? Read book. Check phone. I'm going to check phone. There might be more information on that instead. <gasps> All right. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Grab Snowball. This is war, motherfucker. You think you can take me on? I'm not all well, looks, you know. I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> uh. Yeah! Oh, Suck ha, my great. dick. <laughs> hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chick? Oh, I got this. Sorry. Oh! Ah, <laughs> hey! Burn roll! Oh, snap! No, 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 no. The bird. Don't hit the bird. Little thing. Uh, hello? <laughs> Come on. Where's this cunt? Yeah! Like, Fuck your head. <laughs> uh, you got me. Well, she's killing this guy. Sometimes do nothing is the right thing to do. You can't hide from me, oh. Michael. I yeah, yeah. All your tricks. All right. Okay. All right. Fair enough. I didn't want to hit the birdie. I'm not going to hurt the innocent oh. animal. Right. And then what? Oh. No more. Yeah, oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> Whoa, shit, where'd you come gotcha. from? Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Uh, grab snowball. Ah! Yeah, fuck your eye. Oh ho ho. Okay. No. Okay, you're really gonna get no, it. No, please. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever provided i was making out with you the whole time just making out quote unquote well i think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes yeah was that foreshadowing i better not see a totem of me in a freezer that would not be fucked up what an ending that would be i'm just hoping that when it comes down to it escaping and breaking and Shooting and whatnot is as easy as, as throwing the snowballs was. You know, I, I can handle that. Hello again. Hey, dude. Dr. Hill. And how are we feeling? It's all right. Things are going fine. I'm enjoying it. Seems we're hard to scratch the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. What's with the this tissues, time, man? We're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages, 
You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Oh, fair enough. <clears throat> Let me see. A man or a woman? Women worry me? Men worry me? What? Neither. What? Makes me anxious? N I don't get it. No, can I, can I just change the page? Fuck it. Flip a coin. We'll go with girls. Female. Crowd. No, I'm not, I'm not a fan of crowd. Yeah, crowds can go fuck themselves. I like my indoors. Whoa, shit. Heights. Heights. But that picture of the hand was much creepier. Ooh, a rat or a snake? Uh, well, I've never seen a snake in real life. Or a big rat. But I guess it freaked me out more if I walked into a room and seen a pile of rats than it would if I seen a big snake. So I'm gonna go with rats are creepier. I could take a snake in a fight. I I'd fuck up a python. I'd kick it in the head. Yeah. Guns or knives? Um, not really afraid of either. I guess... If I was walking down the street and someone jumped out at me, I would I would be much more comfortable if he was coming at me with a knife than if he was like five feet away and, and just shooting the shit out of me. So I, I'd go with guns. But in general, neither really. I mean, guns are boring. Oh, fuck. I fear cockroaches. Okay. For the first time in my entire life, I've never seen a cockroach in real life. Two hours ago, I was taking a little nap. I had a dream of a blue cockroach in my shed where we have one of, one of our little freezers and shit. I had a dream I was in there and a blue co cockroach came out of nowhere and started like scattering at me. Like, what the fuck was that about? Uh, I'll, I'll go with rats again, but that's, that's, that's pretty damn cool. Maybe it means something. No, I want to play this game some more. This is fun. I fear scarecrows or clowns. Clowns aren't scary. Fucking it is a shit fucking movie. Who fucking who's afraid of a fat clown? Do the makeup. Gore disgusts me. Crows are scary. Oh, see, this depends on the environment. Well, I guess, like if if I was walking down the street and I seen a, a body like ripped apart and shit, I'd be like, oh fuck this. But when there's like 60 crows on the ceiling outside, like we get a bunch of crows around here and they're all like calling and looking down at you, that can be a little intimidating. I never walked around and seen a, and seen a mutilated body though. Um, I'd, I'd go with, I'd, go, I'd, I'd fucking go with gore, I guess. Whoa! Oh. Did I startle you? You so annoyed sorry. me. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. I wonder if this is changing the game settings. Like, oh, now the bad guy's gonna be a scarecrow instead of a stupid Speed ass the more you rely clown. On your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay. Uh, speed round. Spiders. Fuck spiders. Yeah, get rid of that shit. Gore. I, I don't like needles. I don't like hospitals. I had some bad issues with doctors in the past and creepy ass hospitals at nighttime. Hell no. Zombies are fucking cool. I'm gonna go with Scarecrow again. Zombies are cool as shit though. Ooh. I don't, who the f How dare you be afraid of dogs? Dogs are the cutest motherfuckers in existence. Uh, again with the needles. Get that shit away from me. Button crap in my body. Thank you for answering so diligent. No problem, man. How are you doing? Spiders, scarecrows, and needles. <laughs> the sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. You got good teeth, dude. You must have a great dentist. And I like your hair. 
This guy be all sort of styling. Look at that chair in the back. You think he got that for cheap? Hell no. That's one expensive motherfucker. <laughs> 